Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys on this Sunday afternoon. If you notice something a little bit different about me, I just shaved my face, which I haven't done in like six months or even longer. Um, my roommate dared me to do it, so it looks a lot different, but the hair will be back in like a week or so, so whatever, but <laughs> today we are on our Let's Clash account. As you guys can see, um, we've got a lot of loot, and a lot of that is thanks to this one week uh, gym boost that Supercell has so nicely given all of us. Um, what we're going to be doing in this episode today is hopefully, I'm going to go ahead and just finish this up, actually, since there's only 24 gems. Nice, level 72, sweet. Um, but we've got so much gold right now, and we need something to do with it. We've also almost got 15,000 uh, Dark Elixir, so why don't we try, right, we've got a, uh, what would this even be called? Um, Bamlin or something? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, no, there wouldn't be an M in that, I don't know. Um, <clears throat> uh, but yeah, so what we're going to do is we're definitely going to upgrade two gold things. We can also research, so why don't we start off with... Uh, researching, what should we research? Um, I guess balloons. Um, we can either do balloons or we can do wall breakers. Uh, I don't think I've had too much trouble with wall breakers, so why don't we go ahead and do balloons and then maybe we can do some balloon raids in the future or something like that. So that took up the majority of our elixir, but we do have four million gold left. I think we could even upgrade our town hall with that. Yeah, we could. Um, but what we're going to be doing um, today, I definitely want to upgrade some uh, cannons. Let's see, so our archer towers are all at 9, I believe. 9, 9, 9, um, 9. Yep, so all of our archer towers are at 9 right now. Um, and you know what I just realized? Oh, wait, never mind. Uh, and then one of our cannons is at level 10. So this cannon right here is maxed. Um, so why don't we upgrade one cannon, uh, the wizard tower right here is going to be done in 18 hours, and then this gold, or this elixir collector is going to be done in 15 hours, and then, uh, we'll farm a little bit more, and then we'll do another Let's Clash episode where we upgrade, um, two things hopefully. So, let's go ahead and upgrade one of our archer towers, so let's upgrade this one right here, it's going to be done in five days, uh, which is going to take forever. And um, let's see what kind of stats we got from that. So we're going to get 9 more damage from that. We're going to get 30 more hit points. Um, and then I believe that that will be max for Town Hall 8. Um, and then let's go ahead and upgrade one of our cannons as well. So we'll upgrade this one on the opposite side. And then that will give us 200,000 gold left. So that's good. That way we're protecting our resources. Um, and we're not saving up for something ridiculous. Uh, <laughs> so that people can't steal everything. We could have done a Tesla, but... That's fine. I'm fine with what we did. So let's go ahead and break the shield. We're going to go ahead and attack. Um, well, wait a second. Oh, that's a good amount of of elixir right there, that, or dark elixir that I would love to be able to get to. Um, let's see if we can... I'm going to take out this mortar right here, and then let's attack from the top portion of the base. Um, I might go ahead and drop down my king as well, and then we'll throw down some archers. And hopefully we can get in there. If we can get that elixir, then we'll be able to upgrade our king as well. Um, well, no, we won't because uh, of our builders. So let's get some of our goblins up in here. Um, we're going to let <coughs> our barbarians continue working their way around, doing some serious work. You can see they're just breaking through everything. Um, and then let's go ahead and drop off some of our goblins right here. Yep, that's going to be perfect. They're going to get in there to that gold and then... Hopefully that means they'll be able to get into uh, that elixir as well. Let's drop off some barbarians up here as a distraction. This is going to be perfect. All these goblins are about to go into the middle. We're going to drop the rest of them and let them rush in there. Once they get through that wall, they're going to get all of that dark elixir for me. As long as those mortars don't do too much damage. And there goes all the dark elixir. That's awesome. There's only 30 left. And uh, I imagine it is in this collector right over here. So we don't have anything to worry about now uh, <laughs> from the standpoint of resources. I'm not really too worried about trophies, so that was a great raid. Um, we got all that dark elixir, which is exactly what I wanted to happen. 40% um, right now. We're just going to go ahead and surrender in the battle right there. Uh, that's a great raid for me. That's an awesome amount of dark elixir, like I was saying. Uh, so, yeah. But can we... Um, we can. So we can upgrade him. We're going to go ahead and do that. No, we can't. And he's a builder. 
<laughs> For some reason, I thought that I wouldn't need a builder. I almost want to just go ahead and finish this. Let's just finish this. We're doing it, all right? We're, we're doing crazy things. So we finished that. Uh, let's boost this thing as well. Um, I accidentally upgraded it when I was trying to boost it, and it's been doing it for the last couple of days. So we're going to go ahead and upgrade our king. Here we go. He is going to be going up to uh, level 3 now, I believe. Yep, level 3. So that's going to be great. Um, why don't we train up a army comp of uh, giants and goblins as well, so we can just keep on farming. We're going to do 20 giants. I love this strategy. Uh, I think that it works pretty well. And one, two, three, four, five. We'll, we'll leave some archers in there, but mainly we're going to do goblins. Let's do about 50 goblins and then throw in some more archers. And, yeah. Bring in all these archers. There we go. So that's it. 30 minutes, 19 minutes. Let's take some of these wall breakers and put them over here. And we also don't need six in this one. 19 minutes, 25 minutes, 23 minutes and 24 so let's add two more wall breakers to that one and two just to get that closer to being even and we are going to end it right there um at six minutes i thought it was going to be a little bit shorter so that's okay um let's see how uh our defense has been doing i haven't really looked at this in a while this guy got a whole bunch of loot right there at the bottom let's watch this i know the majority of that is from the collectors because um, as you can see, they are practically full. Look at that. That's all full from the uh, from the boost. So this guy had a chance to get almost... No, he had a chance to get a million resources from me because I hadn't been on in like a day. So that's freaking crazy that you can find bases like this. Um, let's go ahead and fast forward and just see what happens. I don't think he makes it into the center of the base where all that gold is. Um, but as you can see, he's working his way around to all the pumps and whatnot. He's got a bunch of wizards up there at the top, so he's definitely going to get those resources. And he's got some. He's got a heal spell up there as well. Um, he's working his way in. He's going to get that dark elixir. I believe he gets the dark elixir. No, he didn't. See, as you can see, he didn't even get into that center core where the dark elixir um, or those gold storages was, and he's still got so much loot. So I'm not worried about that. That shows that the base still did pretty well at protecting what I had in the middle. It's just because these collectors... Uh, <laughs> were so freaking full of um, loot that he just stole all of that. So definitely keep an eye out for great, great loot over the next couple of days, guys, um, because you're going to find a lot of really, really good stuff. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. Um, I'm going to be streaming every single day this week, so definitely stop by the streams. It's going to be at around 1 or 2 o'clock Eastern specific time. So I live in North Carolina, so check out what time it is there. 2 o'clock, uh, generally for about two and a half hours, maybe to 4, 30 or 5, um, two and a half to three hours. So definitely stop by the stream, guys. Uh, yeah, I'm doing this full time now, so you guys are going to see a lot more videos. You're going to see a lot more streaming. So thank you so much for the support. I really do appreciate it. If you guys want to stop by the stream and subscribe there, uh, you're going to hang out and talk to me and have a lot of fun. So yeah, make sure you guys stop by the next stream tomorrow at 2 o'clock Eastern time. Um, thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. And as always... Make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later.